Hello, welcome back to my second video for Movember in partnership with Gillette. If you missed my first video, we did a classic designer stubble look and I'll be making sure that I leave a link below for you guys to check that out. So please do and let me know your thoughts on that. In today's video, if you haven't already noticed, I'm sporting a clean shave. So we're gonna be going over my clean shaving routine. I hope you enjoy it. It's probably been about two years since I've actually clean shaven. So it feels very weird, very surreal. In fact, it sort of takes me back to like the first date I ever had with Lydia and I turned up and I was completely barefaced and it's probably one of the last photos of me as well where I actually haven't got any facial hair and so that's going back four years but I'm sure I did continue to wet shave throughout the start of our relationship. But yes, today's video is for Movember. Movember is a great cause to raise awareness for various types of cancers such as prostate and testicular. So their main focus is to try and change the face of men's health over the month of November. And that's exactly why this video is here today. So with everything Movember, obviously there's gonna be a lot of attention and focus on men's facial hair. So I thought that what a good time to do a couple of videos to make sure that your facial hair was looking on point and you were just well groomed. So I hope you enjoyed today's video and I'd love to hear your thoughts on it and let me know if you wanna see more of these types of videos. But without further ado, let's get started. First up, comb out your beard and cleanse your face in warm water. Apply an exfoliator or face wash to get rid of any excess dirt. When you're applying the exfoliator, make sure that you work it into the skin in a circular motion and make sure you get great coverage over the face. With a towel, dab dry, but make sure that you leave some moisture on your face so when you apply your shaving gel, the application is a lot easier. Squirt the gel into your hands at about the size of a two pence piece. Work into the skin in a circular motion, making sure that you get great coverage over the hair. Reapply the shaving gel as you go because it will dry out during the shaving process. Let the gel set into the skin and get to work. It will soften the whiskers and it will prepare the skin for a wet shave. Now onto the fun part. When selecting your razor, check the head to make sure that it is fresh, clean and sharp. Nobody likes shaving with a blunt razor. Pull the skin taut, apply the blade carefully and drag down with the grain of the hair. Remember to continuously run the razor under running water to get rid of any excess cream or hair that's been collecting on the blade. Shaving in the same direction as the hair growth will help to avoid irritation. Don't forget to reapply any shaving gel that's washed off or dries up during the shaving process. Of course, we've taken a pit stop on the moustache or the moustache. Either way, we've taken a pause and obviously this is what this whole video is sort of about, trying to raise awareness for Movember and yeah, I'm feeling some Freddie Mercury vibes. As much as Freddie Mercury is an absolute legend, I've got to get rid of this moustache. So the final little bits of hair are being removed and then we're nearly completed on this look today. So I'm just using the raw head on the Gillette Styler just to finish off and tidy up those last little bits and make sure those sideburns are looking on point. Last but not least, I'm gonna be applying a soothing aftershave balm just to keep the skin moisturized and relaxed after its first shave in two years. Don't forget, it's not too late to do your bit for men's health. Head over to uk.movember.com to find out more. Thanks for watching guys and we'll see you on the next one.